So, pronated foot. He doesn't have a pronated foot, but we'll imagine he does. So if he had a pronated foot, it would be looking like this. But he doesn't have a pronated foot. Relax for me. Right there. I start to feel the resistance of his tissues, you know, just that's where I want to begin. That's where his foot's going to hit the ground. Hold it right there. So we would spray this well. We're trying to, because he's so much like this, we're trying to pull this side down. So we're going to be here. We'd spray the foot nicely. You guys didn't catch me on that. Come on. We gotta do it again. Then we'll come across to number one. And we're going to form that metatarsal arch, which is going to help absorb impact. Now for someone weighing, you know, more weight, more than 130 pounds, I'd probably come because I'm trying to pull this down. I'll come here, pin it, come around, and go five to one. And this is going to assist in the elasticity and the absorption of impact when the foot splays and the foot goes once to do this this piece around here is going to further support that somebody really light I might not do the five to one at all Because I'm trying to pull this side of the foot down, I'm going to start here, cover all my tape ends, and my motion with the elastic tape, I'm going to overlap a half of with the tape each time, pulling number five down. And I'll take my non-elastic tape. Just like that. 